Saturday. I'm actually about to head out and go to brunch with my friend Ellen. But yeah, I figured I would film just like a little weekend in my life. We do have a bit of plans for this weekend. We're going to Carbone Monday, which I'm super excited about. So I figured I would just, you know, take you guys along. It was snowing here earlier today. I don't know if it's going to continue or what the case is, but I guess we'll see. But before I head out, I just want to quickly show you guys my outfit. Like I said, please ignore the back, it's a mess. I'm just wearing this little crop sweater underneath. Like I said, it's freezing, so I'm definitely going for just more warmth. Threw my white coat over this tan scarf that I got in London. Paired it with my Telfizi. And then I'm just wearing these new Curve Love jeans I got from Abercrombie. I really love them. And then just wearing some up. So I'll catch up with you guys when I get there. later i'm sitting here having a nice little glass of wine this is actually sarah jessica parker's wine i think it's like a collab or something she did but i've had myself a day like i told you i hung out with my friend ellen we got some brunch had a great time and to be honest i don't really think i did anything oh yeah i went to hudson yards like the mall did a little bit of shopping went to whole foods so that kind of stuff but i was really just so tired today because between jay and the dogs last night both of them were just like waking up the dogs barking just like for no reason so i didn't really get the best sleep which is probably why i feel like i did a lot today although i really didn't but anyway it's nighttime as you guys could see i just showered all that stuff i'm about to start doing my skincare routine but i'm really excited because i don't think i vlogged when we actually did this but a few days ago we booked our flights for a honeymoon super excited because it's actually in like a few months <laughs> we have nothing booked so we really have to get on that that's kind of what we're planning to do tonight jay's honestly done a lot of research and i've just been looking at tiktoks so i really just have to sit down and just look at everything figure it all out so we could really just book our hotels our you know any activities you want to do that kind of stuff in a few days we're actually heading to florida if you guys didn't see my last vlogmas video definitely check it out but basically jay surprised me with the best surprise ever which was essentially tickets to go see my grandparents in florida i don't really get to see them that often just because you know like i said they're in florida and where they live in florida tickets there is as much as going to europe it's insane so we really don't see them as often as we would like to but i'm really excited to go down be in the sun not have to wear like 20 layers and just have ourselves you know a mini weekend vacation i'm pretty sure jay has only ever really been to disney so i'm excited to you know show him where my grandparents are from fun fact my parents actually almost moved to florida when i was much younger like i'm pretty sure they put a down payment on a house and everything and then last minute just decided yeah we're staying in new york so just imagine how different my life would have been living in florida i feel like i'm such a city girl such a new yorker i honestly just can't imagine me living anywhere else besides maybe london but that's really it so yeah we're pretty excited for that like i said we're only going for a few days just a cute quick short trip i'm sure my grandparents are super excited as well because we all pretty much live in new york or just out of state only one of my these lives in florida so they don't really get to see their grandchildren that often so it'll definitely be a fun little trip and of course i'll vlog that for you guys my under eyes look crazy because i used tretinoin this week i use tretinoin every week but in the winter months like my skin just peels like crazy when i use it i don't know why but yeah that's why my skin looks a little crazy right now but i know in like a week it'll be baby smooth like i said i've been filming a lot of those little get ready with me videos and i think i'm gonna keep doing it because it seems to be doing pretty well on tiktok i also shared a few stories of my time at nyu so definitely check it out if that's something you're interested in i think i'll maybe do a few more stories on tiktok about my time there just because you know i studied abroad i you know 
I did a lot. So I think those would be funny, you know, stories to share with everyone. But yeah, like I said, tonight just gonna focus on more stuff for the honeymoon. And then tomorrow, really gonna focus on prepping and packing for our trip. I desperately need to get a pedicure. Like, I haven't gotten a pedicure since the summer. Since the summer. Since August, like beginning of August, before I we went to North Carolina. That's really bad. So <laughs> my toes need it. They need help. And gonna go do that as well as, you know, starting to pack. I have gained a bit of weight since the summer, which is fine. Like it is what it is. Um, it's really just because I'm still having issues with like my gallbladder. I don't have a gallbladder, but removing it has caused more issues for me. So I've been doing a lot of tests recently for that as well. But yeah, so I think I gained maybe like five, seven pounds, which again, not a big deal, totally normal. Nothing crazy, like I still love myself, still love the way I look. So definitely don't let that get in your head. But I'm not sure if all of my clothes that I wore last year will really fit me. And I don't have time to get other clothes. Like, you know, it's freezing here in New York City. It's snowing. There's no way I'm going to walk into a store and be able to, like, find a bikini or anything like that. So I'm just going to see what I have, work with what I got. If anything, when I'm down in Florida, I'll just buy stuff if I need to. And then, like I said, Monday, super excited. Finally got reservations at Carbone. It's funny because I was actually looking at, like, my photos from last year when I did my, um, like, 2022 recap on TikTok. And this time last year, this exact week, maybe even the same day, was the last time we went to Carbo. So a whole year it's taking us to go back, which is just crazy. I'm also excited because we have a gift card. My parents got us that for our anniversary. Our anniversary was also in September. So the fact that we haven't been able to get a reservation until now is just crazy, but it's fine. It will definitely be fun. I'm excited to get a ton of food because my parents gave us a really nice gift card. So that'll definitely be fun. And of course, I'll take you guys along with that. And yeah, anything else to get up to, I will take you guys along. Hey guys, happy Sunday. It's a beautiful day here in New York City, so I'm about to get ready so we can head on out. As you guys saw, we had pretty much a slow morning. We stayed up pretty late last night doing some research for a honeymoon, which unfortunately I couldn't show you guys because then you would know where we're going. And like I said, just kind of want to have everything booked before sharing where we're going. So now I'm just quickly doing my skincare. I do want to take some content today because I feel like I haven't really taken photos in a while. Like when we went to London, Amsterdam, I was just taking so many photos. And then over, you know, the holiday season, I was really just taking more, you know, TikToks, reels, shorts, that kind of stuff. And then I took photos for New Year's Eve and haven't really taken photos since. So that's on, you know, my to-do list for today. And then, like I said, later on, just really start the packing process. But before we do that, I think we're going to stop by Crate and Barrel and CB2 because I think it's time we finally finish furnishing this apartment. We've been living here for, what, like seven months, I want to say? I think seven months. And... It's just time to finish it. We really just put it off for one, the wedding, and then all of our trips, and then, you know, everything with Simba. So it's just like, okay, we just gotta, we just gotta finish it. So that's on our list for today as well. If you guys follow me on TikTok, you would have seen, I put like a little poll asking you guys like your opinion on the different furniture pieces I was looking at. It's funny though, because everyone voted pretty much the opposite of the ones I was planning to get. So I don't know, I still think I may get the ones that I wanted anyway, just because I think the issue was that I didn't really explain where I'm putting these pieces. So like for instance, I put a mirror, but this isn't going to be like my usual, you know, OOTD mirror, like that's this mirror. Um, but I just wanted like a little cool funky mirror to put in the living room because I feel like everything in the living room is just too perfect like it's just all very like white neutral grays like there's nothing really you know funky going on so i just really think i wanted to add like a little bit of fun in the living room and i'm not that into like art pieces i mean i am it's just 
I just can't find one that I really genuinely think that I'm gonna want to look at every single day So for now just keeping the walls bare I think I mentioned in one of my last videos that Jay and I are actually trying to do a little project I guess of our own to put some art in here so maybe we should do that today as well. We just have to get the frame, but we already have what we're putting inside of it. I just don't know if I want to put that above our bed or in the living room, but we'll figure that out another time. Yeah, like I said, just getting ready. Hopefully we figure out the furniture pieces so I can just order it all. And hopefully it'll be here within the next few months because I know that these things take a while to get here. So this is my final outfit for today. I'm wearing this sweatsuit that Jay actually got me for Christmas from Zara. It's really cute. I'm wearing my Jordan. I actually don't know what these are called, but I love them and I thought it matched perfectly. Then I just threw on my Zara long coat that you guys have seen me wear a ton before and also my furry Zara purse. And then I just paired it with these AirPods because I've been wanting to take a photo with them and it just haven't. So figure today, might as well go for like the cozier vibes. And I also just want to be cozy today. So I'll catch up with you guys when we're there. <laughs> Hey guys we're back home as you can see we actually didn't end up going shopping at all just because it's absolutely freezing here today and i was just not really feeling it it's almost you know the time of the month and i was just like you know what let's just go get some food so we picked up some pizza took some content and now we're home jay just made me this delicious little hot chocolate oh a simba wants to come through jay just made me this delicious little hot chocolate so i'm about to dive in Probably going to spend the rest of the night focusing on honeymoon related stuff, watching the Rangers game because it's on right now. And then I also really just want to, like I said, just order the furniture. So we already saw the CV2 table that we want in person, so we know what that looks like. We were going to try and see the one from Crate and Barrel, but I did read the reviews for both and it seems that both chip. So a lot of people said that they ended up buying like a glass table thing to put on top of it i don't know if that's what i really want to do so still trying to figure that whole situation out but we definitely figured out what mirror we want to get we've actually wanted this mirror even when we were in our old apartment um but we were going to do it horizontally but we have like a little space here our plan is to put the mirror on this little space here so we kind of want something a little more funky and then i also really want to get a floor lamp because as you can see there's no light inside our living room the only light we have is in the kitchen and like the little hall space so yeah desperately need a lamp we've been needing one for quite a bit but i think it's time hey guys it's the next day as you can see i just did my makeup got ready and we're about to head out to carone i filmed a little get ready with me portion on tiktok so go check it out really excited for this reservation because my parents were also kind enough to give us a little gift certificate so we're definitely gonna eat really good tonight but of course before we go i want to quickly show you guys my outfit this is just my outfit for tonight. I wore this not that long ago, but didn't get a photo. And you know I'm getting a photo tonight. At least, hopefully, I will. But yeah, basically this top, I think, is from Zara. It's kind of interesting. Like, the cuts on the bottom aren't the same, but it's pretty cute. Wearing my Abercrombie jeans that you guys know I just love. The Curve Love ones. I'll try and have everything linked down below. And then I'm wearing my Tony Bianco booties. You guys know I wear these literally every time I go out. They're just comfortable, easy to pair with things. I love it. And then pairing everything with my Prada purse as usual. You would think this was the only purse I had. Or this and the Telfar because I feel like I just switched between those two. But I just love that I could put this right on my shoulder. And you know walking in New York City. I really want to like have something on my shoulder so it's just like safe and secure with me. But anyway, enough of me chatting. Let's head to Carbone. And look how handsome my husband looks. We're kind of matching actually. I know. I just realized. I saw your outfit. I was like, oh, I know the color palette for tonight. <laughs> okay, well tell them where everything's from. Uh, Zara. Zara. Uniqlo. Uh, I'm not sure where the dresses are from. They're a little old. Cassel from the white. 
and weathering from the white. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Also guys, earlier today, I was feeling pretty down just like with the Monday blues and I popped a vitamin D, vitamin whatever, a supplement before I was getting ready and suddenly I'm in an amazing mood. So maybe I just need to take that every single day of my life for the rest of my life so that I'm just this happy all the time. But yeah, I'll see you guys when we get there. I haven't packed a single thing and our flights I think at like 12 tomorrow so time to get on it and I think I'll just do a little montage for you guys I'm not planning on bringing too much because I don't think I want to check a bag we're really only there for like four days five days maybe so I don't really see the need but I have my little bees weekender bag and then I also have my little carry-on suitcase so time to get to packing mm -hmm. 